What's happening everyone? It's Abdallah here with another exciting tips and tricks tutorial video for Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Today's video is showcasing exactly how to unlock the secret character Monk Maz Koshia. Yes, those of you guys who have played Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild Champions Ballad, that secret final boss at the very end, he's a playable character in the game and we're gonna show you how to get him super easily. So, thanks so much for watching. Now, if you guys have not already hit that subscribe button, please do so. We are on a rally to get to 1 million subscribers and at 850, we are going to give away a Nintendo Switch. So, hit that subscribe button, join us. And if you guys didn't already take a look at our playlist over here, we've got tons happening on the channel. We've got a walkthrough that we're doing and of course some tips and tricks videos. Also, if you want to win a copy of Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity, visit my Facebook. We got a little something extra going on over there for you guys. So, all right, let's jump into this. In order to unlock this secret character, you're going to need to beat the second level within Chapter 4 to unlock this brand new quest called Trial of Monsters, which requires about 5 ethereal stones and a bunch of enemy trophies. There's no battle needed, so you're all good as long as you have those items. After that, you're going to head on over here towards the east for the Trial of the Mighty Foe, which requires 10 ethereal stones and even bigger enemy trophies, specifically from the Stone Talus, Henax, and the Lynels. Now, if you're looking for ethereal stones you're gonna need to keep on doing challenge missions and all these other side quests and you'll be able to collect many of them you'll need about 22 for this entire quest now our last one is going to be right towards Lurlin village right over to the east you'll need seven ethereal stones and a bunch of precious stones such as amber topaz ruby and diamond now once you've done those three quests, which require no battles, just a lot of materials, you'll unlock the Trial of the Ancients. Now this is over in the southern area of central Hyrule, where you will have to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Monk Maz Koshia himself. Now this guy is a huge threat in the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, if you guys have played through the Champion's Ballad. Like I told you guys earlier, he's the super secret final boss, and that's how you unlock the Master Cycle Zero. So. This battle is going to be relatively easy. I don't think it's going to be as hard as it was in Breath of the Wild. But as long as you guys know the basics of how to play this game, and trust me, by the time you get to this point in the later half of Chapter 4, you guys already know about flurry rushes. You know how to use all the different runes in order to counter things and then activate enemies' weak point gauges. You know how to use your special attacks. And by this time, I'm pretty sure you know how to do Link's combos. So... This battle is going to be relatively easy, provided that you know the basics. You can take a look at him over here. If you're very far away from him, he will absolutely throw some of the spears your way. He summons two clones, and he's able to do either the spear throw, he can do like a spear swipe, he also has a gigantic hammer that he throws down that he just materializes out of nowhere. He does bomb explosions, and you can see over here that he's got his gigantic spiked balls, in which you can uh, do some flurry rush dodging or you can use magnesis in order to counteract that. But anyway, get his weak point gauge down and you should be able to knock him out relatively quickly. So I'm going to leave you with the rest of this boss battle and uh, a little bit later on we're going to show you exactly how this character plays when we go into his training. Boom! That is the last one. That's the last hit right there. Exemplary, you have proven your competence. I will lend you my power. May the goddess protect you. So that is exactly how you're going to unlock this secret character. Just by putting out a lot of the ethereal stones and a lot of the different trophies and precious stones, 
you're going to be all set with unlocking a brand new character that you can bring throughout the entire story mode. So you'll get a whole bunch of new weapons, you'll get some other materials that are relatively rare, but as you can see, the game is going to be even better now that you got Monk Mazkoshia, Conduit of the Goddess, a powerful Sheikah monk from 10,000 years past. He is one of the few who have received revelation from the goddess Hylia. He has awaited the chosen hero's arrival within the Shrine of Trials. Now, what's really awesome about him is that if you guys enjoy the gameplay from Impa, you are going to love this character. Now, he has the ability to have these different seals, but he has way more of them. So going over to Monk's training over here will allow you to try him out a little bit. If you use ZR, if you try out his YX combos, his YYX combos, you'll be all set and ready to go. So let's jump in and show you guys exactly the sheer power of this character. Now, I think his gimmick is really, really fun. Now, instead of making a whole bunch of clones like Impa does, this guy goes gigantic. So he's got Monk's Bands, as you can see here. That's the kind of weapon that he uses. So you're gonna be collecting all those sorts of rare ones. And if you press ZR, he's able to go and go massive. Like, that's, it's just so hilarious. Like, go massive, boom. So you'll notice underneath his special meter, you'll see that he's got six of the different little symbols over there, kind of like Impa does. Now, whenever you do one of the very strong attacks, and those, like this one right over here, the spiked balls, for example, whenever you do those, you'll be able to get even more of the lit up symbols here. And then the moment that you press the ZR button, you'll be able to do one very, very strong attack, which makes him go massive. This is a special right over here. It's uh, pretty great. I mean, he throws an area of effect like gigantic orb, and it destroys everyone in that little area there. So I think he's awesome. You can actually just keep on spinning around with him and just do a bunch of damage. So he's very good at crowd control. Uh, maybe not as good as, like, let's say, Rivali is, but I would say he's really great. So that right there is pressing the ZR button and then going massive. It's just so hilarious to see this, like, skinny monk guy that's over 10,000 years old simply just spawn all of his clones and just keep on attacking you. I would say his area of effect for his neutral attacks, like his sword swipes, are pretty wide. I would say so, why the heck not? And then right over here, you can keep on pressing repeatedly for certain moves, and then this is his weak point smash where he just literally steps on everyone. And yeah, and then he just goes shrinks down to like this little shrunken head character, so I love him. I think he's gonna be really, really fun. So anyway, I'll give you guys a little bit more gameplay of this and we'll go from there. So enjoy him. Let me know what combos you guys find very helpful in the comment section below. Can't wait to hear from him. Well, there you have it, ladies and gents, how exactly to get the brand new secret character of Maz Koshia. What do you guys think of the monk? I think he's really fun, and I cannot wait to unlock even more about him, right? I'm sure he's got even more combos that I just got to work on, so seriously. He is so much fun. Make sure you guys play up to chapter four and get him. Again, like I said earlier, let me know in the comments what kind of combos you enjoy from him. And if you guys didn't already take a look at our giveaways that we're doing on the channel, definitely do so. It's super fun and I love giving back to the community. All right, you guys, subscribe, turn on notifications. If you guys wanna watch more, there's gonna be some playlists on screen over here. We've got tips and tricks and we've got a full walkthrough. So do it and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.